That's right, before I talk to one of the Bruise Brothers, I want you people at home and here at the arena to listen to what I have to say. Now, the 4th of July, there's going to be a big extravaganza at the pavilion. We're not going to be here Saturday, the 4th of July. We're going to be at the pavilion. There's going to be wrestling matches there. It's going to start at 7 p.m. They're going to have live bands. And after the matches, you can park your car in the pavilion itself and watch the fireworks. Now, don't forget that the 4th of July, big extravaganza starts at 7 p.m. And you people here that have ringside tickets, those will be honored at the same place, just the same as in the pavilion, the same way. If you have ringside here, you have those same tickets there. 7 p.m., two big live bands. Now, I know you're going to be at that 4th of July special, Brother Big Extravaganza, but right now you got your hands full with uh, that blonde Madonna lookalike, C.W. Berksum. You know, Al Madrill? CW is scheduled to wrestle my brother tonight, but being the coward that he is, he took a chair to him in Longview. My brother's got a concussion, and I will say this, he took a chair to the back of his head. You ain't got the guts to hit the man square on, boy. Well, I'm going to tell you right now, you got to face me tonight, and I'm going to show you what it's all about, CW. I'm going to beat you one, two, three in the middle of that ring. But not only that, I'm going to hurt you, I'm going to hurt you bad, and then I'm going to hurt you some more. Because I guarantee you, you people ain't going to see him get up and walk to the back. When I get done with you, boy, you're going to be laying there like some kind of little kid having somebody haul your big, blonde, coward-looking butt to the back. <laughs> Fireworks starting early, baby. They're starting tonight. <laughs> we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> C.W. Bergstrom, this feud that you've been having with the Bruise Brothers is coming to a head tonight. You have got Don Harris in a tremendous, I don't know, it's a kind of a rematch, grudge match tonight. And uh, man, I'll tell you, after everything they've done to you, I know that you've got a lot of scores to settle, and I think you got your score sheet out. i got a lot of scores to settle, Don. I'll tell you what. I think old Donnie got his back screwed up. I didn't hit anybody in the back of the head with a chair. I hit it straight on, and he was looking at me when I nailed him with it. I'll tell you what, Don Harris, you're up here shooting your mouth off. What are you going to do to me? Well, I'll tell you what. It's one thing to talk about it, and it's another thing to get the job done. At least it didn't take two of me to put your brother out. Well, that's another thing that's been going on throughout the entire Northwest. It's always somebody interfering, always somebody coming in with a friend or a brother. That's right. New rules, Don. New rules. 